Hi guys, good morning. Welcome back to my channel, or if you guys are new here, welcome. My name is Katie. So right now it is about 8.30 a.m. I look so tired right now because I literally like just rolled out of bed. Um, but today I'm gonna be doing like a full like work day in my life. I definitely have a lot that I need to get done today because last week I slacked so, so much. I don't know why, it was just like such a weird week for me. So the first step of my day is literally always making coffee. So that's what we're gonna go ahead and do right now. Okay guys, so it's now actually about 10 a.m. I just finished um, drinking my coffee and replying to some emails. I planned out my day, what I need to film today, what I need to shoot today for an Instagram giveaway, all that stuff, and it took a little bit longer than I expected. So I'm gonna go ahead and hop in the shower. Um, I need to wash my hair and everything, and then while my hair is drying, I'm gonna make some breakfast. I'll show you guys what I'm making and my vitamins and what I'm taking to like stay feeling good and healthy and alert and awake and alive and not like a bum. So yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and hop in the shower and then I'll check in with you guys right after. shower so while I'm waiting on my hair to kind of dry I'm gonna go ahead and take my vitamins and then make my breakfast so I want to show you guys my vitamins really quickly this is not sponsored whatsoever um, but I actually recently found these on Amazon and I'm obsessed with these vitamins I wanted to share them with you guys really quickly um, oh I forgot one Okay, so the first one that I take is this Mary Ruth's Liquid Morning Multivitamin, and this one is in the raspberry flavor. So this is just what the bottle looks like. So all these products are organic, they're really clean, they're non-GMO, vegan, dairy-free, gluten-free, soy-free, zero sugar, zero fat, um, and then they literally have like so many good vitamins in here. I'm not gonna read them all off. If you guys wanna check these out, I'll have everything linked down below. So you just take two tablespoons of this one every day, and then the other ones that I got from Mary Ruth's are their Omega, and I really like these because they are vegan, and a lot of times, like, Omegas always there like fish oils and stuff like that. Um, so I was really excited to find a vegan one. You just take four of those a day, and honestly, these taste like fruit snacks, so I freaking love taking these. So yummy. And then the next one that I'm gonna take is the liquid probiotic. This is just what this one looks like. Um, and I like this because it's actually unflavored, so it literally doesn't taste like anything, it just tastes like water. There are 12 life strains, and it's vegan, and it's raw, so all of the goodies. And the next one that I picked up is their organic liquid elderberry. So this one is obviously for immunity and with everything going around. I'm gonna take all the immunity support that I can get right now. So this one comes in a dropper two. And honestly, it tastes so good. It reminds me of like, a blueberry syrup that my mom used to make when I was a little kid. Um, and then the very last thing that I'm gonna take is just my vitamin C gummies. These are so much fun and I take them every single day. So you just take two of those. So that's literally like my full vitamin routine. So I will have all of these linked down below for you guys to check out. Um, like I said, it's not sponsored, but I was able to get a discount code for you guys. So if you guys wanna get either 10% off or $10 off, I'll have that link down below so you guys can check that out. But anyway, so yeah, so now I'm gonna go ahead and make breakfast. I think I'm just gonna make a strawberry banana smoothie. I've really been loving those lately with some protein in it. So that's what I'm gonna go ahead and do. So I just finished getting ready. I did my makeup, I did my hair. This is a little bit more dramatic of a makeup than I would normally do, um, but that's okay. I'm actually kind of feeling it today. But anyways, right now I'm gonna go ahead and shoot some pictures. I'm doing a giveaway with Numi hair tools. So I'm really excited for this. I love them. I've been using them literally since I was in 
I don't even know, eighth grade, seventh, eighth grade. Um, so I'm really excited to be doing this giveaway with them. But anyway, so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and shoot right now. I think I'm gonna shoot on this blank wall, honestly. Um, Cause I kind of want the focus more to be like on my hair and on the tools. So I think that's what we're gonna do. Anyways, I'll see you guys after. <laughs> Okay, you guys, I think I got everything that I needed. I love these pictures so much. I definitely tried to do a hair flip and it ended up like this. <laughs> so I stopped trying after that one. So happy with these. Okay, cool. Okay, so it's now actually about 2 p.m. It's pretty late. Um, getting ready and then taking all the pictures took a little bit longer than expected. So the very last thing that I need to do is I just need to um, film a hair video. So I'm gonna be doing like, I think I'm gonna maybe do like five, three minute hairstyles or something like that. Just like fun and easy hairstyles that everybody can do while you're stuck at home. Um, you know, like if you have like a conference call or if you're going to the store, stuff like that, that you're not getting like fully glammed but they're like quick and easy hairstyles plus you guys have really been asking how i do a lot of my like low buns and like sleek buns everything like that so i'm going to be showing all of that in that video but anyways i'm going to go ahead and get that all set up and quickly film that before the light goes i think it's safe to say that kai is ready for me to be done filming and for me to take him to the park huh hi bo <laughs> Okay guys, I just finished filming. So right now I am just sitting here and just reviewing the footage to make sure that I didn't miss anything, um, leave any parts out or anything like that because it's the most frustrating thing if you think you're done filming. So then you leave, you take down all of your stuff, you change um, the lighting changes and then you go back to edit it and you're like missing a piece or some piece was like out of focus or something like that. So I'm just sitting here reviewing everything and making sure that I got everything for the video as well as like the thumbnail, everything like that. And then we're gonna make some lunch do a little brain break um and yeah all that fun stuff <laughs> okay guys so i just finished going through all of the pictures and then i just picked out my favorites now i just need to figure out which ones i want to edit and then go ahead and get that posted and then we're gonna go Okay guys, I just took off my makeup, I put on a sweatshirt. This one is so cute. It's from a shop on Instagram called, I think it's Storm & Co. It's seriously so cute and comfy and it's like so, so soft, um, but it's not like too heavy and thick. So I'll link it down below if you guys wanna check it out. Anyways, but I'm gonna go ahead and get some exercise, take Kai on a little walk, and then I will check in with you guys after. Okay, right, so me and Kai just got back from our walk. It's about 7.30, I am starving. I haven't eaten a lot today because I've been so busy. So honestly, I'm just sitting in my kitchen eating cheese. <laughs> Anyways, so I'm gonna go ahead and make dinner. I'm gonna make some mac and cheese. I use this day of cheese to make it. Um, I make a really good like cheese sauce with almond milk. You can make it with like any kind of milk you want. So yeah, I'm gonna show you guys how to make that really quickly. And then it's actually my mom's birthday today. So I'm gonna FaceTime her and my sister at 7.30. So in like 17 minutes, I need to get cooking. Um, okay, let's start cooking. The cheese is so good, it's so addicting. Okay, so all you need to make this is just your favorite pasta. I am using just some gluten-free macaroni noodles. That's my job, drinking water. It's not me, I promise. Um, and then you're just gonna need your favorite kind of milk. So I personally like using almond milk. I just use this almond breeze one. Um, and then you're just going to need some flour and then vegan butter. Um, the vegan butter, oh gosh, the vegan butter that I like to use is just this Earth Balance one. It's like the most common one I find at the store, but it tastes just like normal butter. Um, so this is one of my faves. And then the secret ingredient that really just ties this cheese sauce together is nutritional yeast. This stuff is so amazing. It has so many benefits. Anyways, but this gets a lot of your nutrients in and it tastes amazing. It makes it nice and cheesy. So this is what you add on. So we're gonna go ahead and get started. So quick side note about this recipe. I don't have like a recipe. I'll try to pay attention to how much I use of each item. Um, but honestly, I just throw stuff together. Like it's not like a rhyme or reason. I just kind of put it all in there and I don't really measure. Okay guys, so to start off the mac and cheese, I'm just taking my butter. I feel like I probably do, I'm gonna say like, Maybe a half cup of butter, honestly. Um, it makes a lot of cheese sauce. I'm gonna let that melt down and then we're gonna add in some flour to like make a roux or whatever it's called. I don't know, I'm not a baker. baker. Anyways, back to eating cheese. Okay, and then once the butter is completely melted, I'm gonna put in some flour. Again, not measuring, um, maybe like, gosh, I don't know, a third cup probably. Um, and you can make this as like thick or as thin as you want. Um, the thicker that you make it right now with like the butter is the thicker the sauce is gonna be. Same thing as if you make it thinner, your sauce is gonna be thinner. 
I personally like my sauce to be a little bit thicker. Okay, and then once you have it at the consistency you want, you're gonna add in your almond milk. Um, so for my almond milk, I'm putting about like, I don't know, two cups in there probably. Um, and then I'm just going to whisk that together. You're gonna wanna let it heat up because um, you want your liquid obviously to be hot before you add in the cheese so that it like melts properly. Okay, and then before you add in your cheese, you're gonna add in your nutritional yeast. Honestly, I put so much of this stuff in here. Like, I just go to town with it. Okay, and you're just gonna whisk all of that together. Okay, and then once that's all combined and it's starting to kind of get hot and thick, that's when you're gonna go ahead and add in your cheese. Like I said, this is just the cheese that I use. This is my favorite. I've literally used this one forever. Um, so I'm literally just gonna dump it all in and then you just stir it until it melts. Okay guys, so it is about 8.30. I just finished eating my dinner, finished FaceTiming my family. So now I'm just sitting here drinking my water and then I'm replying to some comments. Literally so many of you guys have already entered into this giveaway, it's kind of crazy. I literally have over 200 DMs right now because one of like the giveaway rules is just to send me a screenshot that you've <laughs> subscribed to my channel. And so there are a lot of you guys sending them. So this is gonna take me a while to go through. But anyways, yeah, I'm just kind of chilling. It's been a very long and productive day. I'm really happy with everything that I got done. However, my house is an absolute disaster. Like I don't even wanna show you guys. It's so embarrassingly messy. Like I don't think there's one spot of my apartment that's not covered in something right now. Um, anywho, so I'm probably gonna just sit down for a little bit longer and then I need to get up and clean. Oh, I wanted to show you guys this new candle that I got really quickly, um, but this is another Opal House one. If you guys have watched my previous videos, you guys have probably seen. Um, the other one, it's like a, I think it's like a pineapple bamboo or like something. Um, anyways, but this one is amazing too. This one's Isle of the Sky. It's fresh air and coconut water. This one smells so freaking good. It's like not too sweet, not overwhelming, but it just makes your house smell like clean and fresh and like a little bit tropical, but like not too overwhelming. Um, but anyways, yeah, just wanted to share that with you guys really quickly. Cause like so many of you always DM me on Instagram saying that you like love the candles that I recommend. So definitely recommend this one. So I finished cleaning, so now I'm going to make myself a little snack. I'm gonna make some apples and peanut butter. This has literally been an absolute favorite for me um, and just really curbs like my late night craving. So that is what I'm going to make right now. And then I'm just going to sit down and do some editing because I only posted one video last week and I usually have been posting like three or four. Um, so I kinda need to step back up my game. Also, really random side note, but a lot of people are wondering like how to keep like their produce and stuff like that clean because you can't really like Clorox wipe down your produce, I guess. I've literally just been washing my stuff with like soap and water. So like when I'm washing my hands before I make food, I just wash like my produce along with it. Honestly, like I haven't noticed a difference, like it doesn't taste weird or anything like that. Um, obviously just make sure to like rinse it really well, but yeah, anyways, super random. Okay guys, so I have my apples and peanut butter. I'm watching The Blacklist and I'm about to start editing. Right now it's 10.59 to 11. Um, so I'm probably gonna like edit for about another hour and a half or so. And then I'm going to hop in the shower. I always have to shower before bed. I don't know, is that just me? I typically just do a body shower anyways. But yeah, so I'm gonna do that and then I'm probably just gonna go to bed after that. So I'm gonna wrap it up here. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye guys.